Yo, what's up, everybody? What's up, YouTube? And I'm back with another video on our topic I want to talk about today. I'm still, you know, walking outside, you know, showing my exercise, you know. The guy had that size in, so, but, <laughs> but yeah, man, I'm gonna do the talk for y'all. The topic I want to talk about today is was should night was, you know, it's fear, man. In the music business, come on. Top of the about day is Shay Knight. You know, on on why was Shay Knight was a fear man in the music business, and how you know, on how he, you know, you know, kind of was bad guy throughout the death row days. You know, or how he, um, you know, had you know did like things to which he is, you know, basically accused of doing, or how you know, on how Shay Knight was basically a um a bully. You know, on, on on how he, you know, trying to run all his careers, but the topic I'm talking about today is is you know was should night a f um, a fear man in moving business. So, so I'm gonna give out my my opinion about this topic. So about what you know about should night. So okay, okay. I think should night was basically a guy who you know who was you know who was a kind of like a bully. You know, to which he trying to you know. Trying to you know you know trying to extort people, trying to run people's um careers you know on how Shanae basically is a blood you know on folks know that Shanae was a, a gay member but like you know, you know he you know was basically a you know a you know a bully but Shanae was basically a um you know a founder of the row you know back then like the row was basically got Tupac um Snoop Dogg Dr Dre the other um, artists you know back then but like Shanae you know. He was basically involved with a lot of stuff, you know. Uh, to which he got, got, uh, you know, sent back to jail, like things he did in the past, like you know, shooting people, doing things like that. Like people who know that Shanae was basically a, um, he was, you know, part of the Bloods, you know. Yeah, the Bloods basically is a gang in California, you know, which is basically repping the red, you know, how Shanae, you know, got. To the gang and how he um you know, trying to make you know to make the regular label count more of a gang label. To which got a lot of gangs in North California. To which they had a lot of um, people who is you know getting you know getting killed, you know getting shot, you know. And I do believe that Shanae was basically a bully throughout the years, you know. To which that um you know he was a, a guy that. <coughs> Yeah, I said, shit, that was a guy that nobody wanted to miss with, you know, during days. To when he trying to, you know, trying to take over the label. And, like, uh, you know, I said back around 96, Tupac was killed in, in, in Las Vegas, you know. But, like, he was, you know, yeah, I think he was kind of more like a bully, though, towards the, you know, towards the, the I, I said, oh, yeah, I said, I was talking about Instagram, though. Yeah, that shit, was basically, you know, yeah, I think like um, hold on. So I think Bad Boy versus oh, hold on. I think Bad Boy um got Puffy and Biggie, and Death Row got um Tupac and and um Shug Knight. You know, rappers back then like um you know, back then those yeah. I said back then you know the labels. I said the labels kind of like you know feuding, beefing back and forth like this. Yeah, I think it's more about how Tupac. And Biggie Duff got more flame by beefing, you know, on, on how Shanae was, you know, I said got involved with the whole beef, you know, with Puffy, though. But, like, Puffy, you know, he wasn't, you know, into beef that much. But, like, Shanae wanted to have this type of um, war back then. So, we want to make a war beef with Bad Boy versus uh, Death Row. Yeah, but Shanae, you know, he was the type of guy, he just, you know, don't want to mess with it all, like, you know. He got more power to destroy you or to destroy people's careers. Like, you know, he trying to, you know, um, yeah, he trying to, um, you know, um, he trying to stop everything from happening. You know, Shit Knight, yeah, I believe Shit Knight was basically a bully towards, um, you know, Tupac, Sue Dog, you know. 
Yeah, I think since I left the label back in 2001, I think he left the label though. Um, oh uh, no, 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 I, I think he left around 1997, 98, you know, because he want to, you know, I said, yeah, I'm there for, um, dealing with Master P in his, um, label back then, like, took part, uh, yeah. I said, yeah, I was shit night trying to keep him from going to the label though back then. Because she night kind of wants his, you know, like, um, yeah, I think she night was basically a bullet to see dog. Because he wanted to, um, I think she thought he wanted to move on to the label though, and he got mad, so. I think about on how he was bullied throughout the whole years in Death Row. Like, you know, like Death Row was a label. It was founded by his best friend named um, Hario. Yeah, I did a video about that before about on, on how his, his friend um, Hario got, you know, after the bubble got fallen out back then, you know, and somehow his friend got, you know, somehow Hario got it. Um, so, yeah. I said Hario, you know, basically, you know, basically with the prison. You know, and you know, and somehow tonight basically took over the whole, the whole label. So, you know, and folks know what happened to two part though. Uh, you know, on how the thing went down. Like, you know, tonight was basically trying to you know start this whole thing by himself. You know, to involve a lot of um gangs. You know, to where could really have you know a lot of conflict with the label. You know, like Bad Boy versus on Death Row label. You know, they had a lot of, you know, back and forth going on, like, you know, at least to the basic depths of, of Big and Tupac, you know, on how Tupac or Big would be from, you know, same thing you ask, um, as, um, Puffy versus, um, Tonight, though. Yeah, I think the beef started, went back around 94, 95, you know. I think it was, um, I think I went to a party in Atlanta, Georgia, and somehow, you know, I think that Tonight had accused Puffy of, um, any friend or, or somebody I don't know what they yeah I think they um I'm just, I'm just, I think his partner of um she not got to a type of um dispute and somehow things went went to violence uh you know and and, and I think like um I'm just, I think Puffy got blamed for you know for the incident that happened back around ninety four and ninety five you know I think yeah, the puffing shit night beast started happening, you know, and somehow, you know, I think it was scared of shit night. Puffy would, you know, I guess he was, you know, scared of him, but like, yeah, I do believe that shit night was a bully throughout the whole years on death row, and nobody wants to, you know, basically, um, I don't want to get, uh, you know, get along with them, um, you know, with him, but like, yeah, I think shit night, um, label started crumble back around 2001, you know. Yeah, but like, yeah. Like, yeah, four years ago, she night with the prison for murder. You know, oh, um, he was trying to run over, the, run over somebody in um in California over his role in the movie um in the baby movie. You know, he ran out. Yeah, he went out to kind of um. Yeah, I think he went on set. Somehow he ran over two people though, and you know, one of them had died. You know, but like, you know, yeah, he that. Yeah, he doing type of murder, so he doing too many for murder, but yeah, man, yeah, yeah. And Shanae was basically a bully. He was a bully towards the people. And, you know, he was the type of um, guy that was feared, you know, in the music business and how Shanae was basically, you know, trying to, you know, take over the whole label by doing bad stuff, you know, by him trying to, you know, be the the um, biggest dude out there to, you know, do stuff like that, like, you know, cause a fight, shooting. Everybody, but I think it's more about how he gotta be careful. People though, like some people like that can be very much evil and tend to kill anybody. But yeah, I think Biggie. Um, yeah, I think Shania was basically a fear guy. He, you know, got what get. You know, I, I don't see a, um yeah. myself. I don't have no pity for Shania though. Yeah, he got reserved. Is you know, it's time in jail, or prison man. But so so much that I like. Comment and subscribe and tell me what you think about the shit night character. You know, and how he you know was feared guy, so 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 yeah. Yeah, I'll probably reveal probably um later, so peace. I'm out here and take care.